The people that make good pathologists are those sorts of people who want to get an answer. A pathologist is someone who has an inquiring mind. Should be hardworking, conscientious, inquisitive. A pathologist needs to be methodical, a pathologist needs to be analytical. They like fine detail, they want to get the answers right. You need to have an inquiring mind to make sure that you see everything that is there. You know, um, go a step further than what you initially see. Typically you'd be someone who enjoys the scientific basis of medicine. The most important thing about a good pathologist is that he or she never forgets that it's a patient at the end of everything that we do. I'm a forensic pathologist. My role is to do post-mortems. Even though we may not see the face of the patient, we know that we've got a bit of that patient there and we've got to do the best by that patient. Well, often you're trying to make very fine distinctions between appearances that look similar but have got profoundly different clinical outcomes. People talk about pathologists um, being super brainy but not being able to deal with patients. Probably the greatest mis misconception is that the pathology is separated from the patient. And there's that joke about uh, surgeons being able to do everything, physicians knowing everything, but a pathologist knows everything, does everything, but it's usually a day late because the patient's dead. In fact, to be a pathologist, you, re you need really good people skills. So it's a communal exercise rather than a, a solitary exercise as being a general practitioner. You have to be fairly bright to get through uh, the examination process. The exciting thing about being a teacher in, in a medical school is that I'm able to expand their knowledge base. It's incredibly rewarding that you are the last port of call to make the diagnosis. Well, in 10 years I've come from somebody that's just finished my qualifications in pathology to uh, somebody who's run a very busy hospital. Having worked hard that there is and uh, developed that experience that people can then trust me with that sort of final diagnosis. And to have the intellectual stimulation of working with a whole group of people from different backgrounds. I think it's one of the most uh, rewarding aspects of what I do is seeing the light turn on. I wanted a discipline that had good um, work-life balance. You can have a life outside of pathology. Certainly in anatomical pathology, our on-call is not particularly onerous. I think compared with some other specialities, yes, you work hard during work daytime or working hours. It has a, a smaller footprint on your family life. Pathology provides an opportunity to not only diagnose things but also to do research. We've recently found that that disease gene is actually one of the major regulators of tuberculosis susceptibility, so a disease which affects three billion people throughout the world. Um, and we have a major role in providing information for the community about patterns of death. We've got tremendous uh, uh, opportunities in Australia for the future in pathology. That way it's you know, incredibly rewarding that you are able to contribute something which changes the, or advances the practice of medicine. This has an important role in uh, planning, health planning. You are responsible for populations as well as individuals. The so-called translational research is easier to carry out in pathology than in other disciplines. It gives you an opportunity to create things. You can, uh, you can really enjoy the work that you're doing because it's scientifically and academically challenging. Pathology is the basis of medicine. We go into medicine to make a difference. It's thought that between 70 and 80 percent of all medical decisions involve some sort of pathology testing. Whether it's uh, impact in diagnosing a disease or in uh, if necessary solving a mystery. That whatever area of interest you are considering, it's really important that you investigate it thoroughly. They need to consider whether they want a, uh, a specialty that gives them the opportunity to really think, to really use their mind. No day is ever the same. Never had a boring day, ever. I would, I would encourage medical students to incorporate pathology. Fantastic job. I'll say go for it.